every royal family, by its nature, has a certain price that it must pay. Every noble lineage has one loose gene, small as a molecule, flitting around the family pool. It's a sort of thing one sees in Appalachia, <laughs> or in the odd inbred Bichon Reserve. <laughs> It really can be such a nasty stain on the escutcheon when a wisp of DNA begins to fray, then goes astray. <laughs> Caligula had the temper, the Habsburgs had the chin. George the Third went cuckoo bird, and Nero had that violin. <laughs> Richard, you'll remember, had the hump of the withered limb. The bushes of tents were nervous wrecks because their son was dim. But look what happened to him. <laughs> Alas, our family also carries a bit of a curse. <clears throat> but darlings, things could be a great deal worse. Thus ends the verse. Breaks all the pop, son, and so do pop. Paul, son, puppy dogs, candy canes. We breaks all about chocolate Bricks. bunnies, lazy <laughs> afternoons and daisy chains. Oh, like this, you can't help but have a happy home. With style upon grace, a smile upon his face, and all that's missing is a crow. So, Rex all about crows and valentines, that's why people all say, Hey, Rubrek, you're really okay. Isn't he adorable? Rex all about Hugs and Valentines, milkshake animals, fun and laughs. It's all about me, belly rubs, fresh shaved testicles on Christmas Day. A smile, it's a mile and a half, and a lot and a hearty. How'd you do? How'd you do? It's a cinch that we would be a happy family. One plus one plus one makes two. Rubrix, crazy about taxidermy and KY jelly on a rubber <laughs> So give him a chance to breathe. Let him get to know you and you'll agree. Rubrix, all about love. <laughs> <laughs> Who's the happy chappy with the ulcerated ear? Awake all night, hollering out from fear. Rupert. <laughs> Who likes to spend every Saturday at the abattoir? Who gets the cattle prod if he tries to hump the samovar? Who likes to save up all his farts in a mason jar? You guessed it. <laughs> about all. <laughs>